Adelaide, capital of South Australia, one of the world's most progressive green states and host of the Global Leadership Program on the Circular Economy. It's a unique program endorsed by the United Nations Centre for Regional Development, designed to give community, business and government leaders the practical skills to make a difference. Its breadth makes it unique, covering areas which have earned South Australia its international circular economy reputation. At the core of the program are hosted visits to major businesses which are leaders in the circular economy. In five full days you'll see many aspects of the circular economy in practice and you'll learn from the businesses and people who are making it a success. The program covers four themes. Circular economy policy and practice including waste minimization, recycling, climate change, energy efficiency and renewable energy. Water management, how Adelaide's a leader in wastewater reuse, water sensitive urban design, stormwater reuse, wetlands and aquifer storage. Community and society, focusing on how to change behaviour and industry and technology, including innovation incubators and resource efficiency. You will learn from peers, practitioners and projects with the focus on the how part of delivering the circular economy. Learning how to transform ideas into actions. In Adelaide, you'll meet your peers and network with other leaders from around the world. You'll gain practical knowledge from discussing their successes. And you'll develop your own personal action plan and become part of an exclusive alumni. I'm hoping that through this program, they'll be able to take back the ideas, some knowledge, and actually do something and make a difference. It's not that hard, but it does require people to be persistent and to actually give it a go, as we say in Australia, because it's important. The circular economy has transformed Adelaide. See for yourself in one of the world's most livable cities and empower yourself to realise the benefits of the circular economy.